Hey guys, it's Aaron Lewis, and in today's video, I just wanted to introduce you guys to a new little member of our household. Now, for people that already follow me on Instagram, and if you haven't, made sure you go follow me, but for people who do follow me there, I have been posting little Instagram stories of my new little household member. So, for anyone that doesn't follow me there, I'd like you all to meet Violet, my new little Maltese cross chihuahua. So, she is a mulchy. She is two months old. She was a sort of a spur of the moment thing, like we weren't even planning on buying another dog or getting another dog, but my auntie bought her because she sadly had to put down her two dogs a month or two back, I think it was. So she thought she was ready to go out and buy another puppy. She fell in love with this one, but sadly she took her home and she just wasn't ready. She just wasn't feeling it. So I swooped in and said, I'll buy her off of you and I will have her as a little buddy for Scarlet. And they are absolutely in love with each other. They run around the house crazy. The only downside is, is as a lot of you guys do know, we do also own a cat. And the cat is not getting along as well as I would hope with the new little puppy. She gets along fine with Scarlet. But Violet here, she's not a fan, she'll hiss at her, her eyes will go all big, her fur goes all frizzy whenever uh, Violet's around, so we just have to really watch out with that aspect, just in case, you know, we don't want the cat to attack her or anything, because obviously she is just a puppy. But being that she's only two months old, she is still quite a young puppy, so she does sleep her whole day away, she pees and poos in the house. She's not toilet trained yet, but she's always so hungry, aren't you? But when we bought Scarlet, as all of you guys should know if you've watched the introduction video that I made of Scarlet, she was four and a half months old when we got her, and the breeder had already pretty much toilet trained her. She was pretty well trained too, she knew how to sit and all that. But obviously with my mulchy here, Violet, she's still a puppy, so now we have to do all that, which I'm perfectly happy to do. Obviously I didn't get to experience any of it with Scarlet, so it is a learning curve for me. The first day I got her, I didn't get any sleep because I was constantly having to let her out toilet. She does have a little carry box. I'll just insert a little image up the top here. But she does have a little carry box that she sleeps in at night time, just so, you know, she doesn't get up to mischief if I'm sleeping. But for anyone that does own a mulchy, I would really love to hear your guys' opinion on them because obviously I had no intention of buying a mulchy or a Chihuahua or a Maltese of any sort. My next dog was always going to be a, another miniature poodle for Scarlet, but then this came up and I thought, what the heck, I'll just get her. So, for anyone that does own a Mulchi, could you guys leave comments down below of what your experiences are with them, whether they're a good dog, whether they have a good temperament once they get older. I would love to hear your guys' opinions on a Mulchi. So, that would be really good. And if you guys have any Instagram accounts that have Mulchis on it, I would also love to go see those, so just leave them down in the comments below and I'll go check them out. But apart from that, I think that is all I have to fill you guys in on. Obviously she's not de-sexed yet, she won't be for another four months. But as soon as I can get her de-sexed, I will be. So that will be four months, so April, March, around there she'll be getting de-sexed. If you guys want to see that little journey, make sure you let me know down in the comment section below. But that is all for today's video. I do hope you enjoyed meeting my new little puppy here. She's still a bit shy, <laughs> as you can see. But if you guys did enjoy it, make sure you hit that subscribe button. There will be more videos of her coming out over the next coming months, weeks, or days. So if you guys want to see them, make sure you do hit that subscribe button. Give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and stay tuned for more content. Have a good day, guys. Goodbye.